What's going on everybody? This is Jaden with Hide Apple and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to change your public IP address on iOS just in case you've been banned from games, websites, whatever. Let's get started. So in this video, we're going to go through a couple things. I'm going to help you find out what your public IP address is, as well as I'm going to give you some recommendations for an app um, that will help you to change your public IP address. Now, this is not a sponsored video, but before we get started, go ahead and subscribe to this channel if you're new here, as well as follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, or Twitter so you can learn more of how to use your Apple devices. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so first of all, I'm going to show you how to find your public IP address and pretty much what that is when you go to a website or when you go play a game or connect to a server, the company is going to see your public IP address. And what they do is, since if you've done something malicious or whatever that's against their policies, then they will take that IP address and add it to a ban list. So what I'm going to show you how to do is how to change that public IP address. But first, let's go find out what it is. All right, so moving over to my iPhone, I am actually gonna open up Safari and I will type in the search bar, what is my public IP? And click on that. That will take you to a Google search. You can click the first one. And right here, it will show me my IPv6 and my IPv4 address. So I'm gonna take a screenshot of that and what I will do is now I'm going to show you how to change these. That way, when you go to a website or go to a server, it's not showing these addresses that are blocked. So since those companies actually see your IP address and they're banning it, what we're going to do is we're going to mask that address. So when you visit their websites or you open up that game or whatever, their servers are going to see a different IP address, not the real one that you actually have. So the only way to do that is to use something called a VPN service, which will establish a virtual private network connection. Um, so I'm going to show you an app that you can download to try to do that. So let's go to the app store and we're going to type in VPN. Now there, there's a few apps that do the same thing, um, but I'm going to do this one, VPN Hub. Oops. VPN Hub right here, I'm gonna hit get. All right, so now I have the VPN Hub app downloaded. I'm going to open it. Now what you're gonna be careful with, they offer a premium service, but we're gonna bypass all of that. So as you see, start your free week now. I am going to scroll down and say, use free for now. So it'll ask you again, we can hit the X at the top right hand corner, get out of that stuff and we're going to agree and set up now. You're gonna to have to allow this. It's gonna ask if you wanna add VPN configurations. Yes, you wanted to do that. Hit allow, you're gonna put in the code for your phone and send notifications. I'll allow that. So here we are, server location. You can actually change where you want your location to come from. So if you have something that you're trying to visit that's outside of the United States or wherever you are, you can change the server location. So I'm gonna use the United States for now and I'm going to hit the little lock button in the beginning or in the middle and it will say secure connection established. You are now connected. Um, you're now ready to use it, browse, browse safely. I'm gonna hit got it. Now I will go out of there. Now let's go back to Safari and we're gonna refresh this page to show you that my address has now changed. So now my public IP address is different. So now you should be able to access those websites or servers, Instagram, whatever it is you're trying to get that you got banned. This will definitely help you out. So guys, there you have it. Hopefully that works for you. Again, this is not a sponsored video for VPN Hub, but I thought it was a pretty cool app, so check it out for sure. If you're new to this channel, go ahead and subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, or Twitter. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about the video. Uh, if you have any questions, also I'll be responding to every comment. So again, stay tuned so you can learn how to Apple without the E.
me <laughs>